Well, turn in your Bibles, please, to the book of Revelation. Revelation chapter 1 in your Bibles this morning. Well, this is our time together to bask in the glory of our God and Savior. It's our Sunday morning where we get to sing about Him, we get to talk about Him, we get to serve Him, we get to think about Him. And what comes into our minds when we think about God is the most important thing about us, as A.W. Tozer observed. And of course, that is also true of the Lord Jesus Christ. What comes into your mind when you think of the person of Jesus is the most important thing about you, for Jesus is the only begotten Son of God. He is the one who reveals the Father. He is one with the Father. And so, just as we must be careful to guard our hearts, to guard our thoughts, about who God is and how we think of Him, practically. So we must also be careful to guard our thoughts and guard our hearts about how we think about our Lord Jesus Christ, who is the revealer of God. So, let me ask you this question. What does Christ look like? So often we think about Jesus Christ in His humiliation. We think of, perhaps, Sunday school lessons with flannel graphs, a picture of Jesus. Or we think of television shows or movies that portray Jesus Christ, and we get an image of what he may have looked like. Now, of course, all of those traditional images of Christ have very little to do with the historical reality, but more to do with our culture and our traditions. But Jesus Christ was, for a short time, just like one of us in his appearance. However, that was only for a short time. And when you think about the Lord Jesus Christ today, you should not think about him 